late for the speech. Oh, we've got plenty of time. We can even go on rides afterwards. <laughs> the Icarus platform, a feat of modern science and technology. This city in the clouds was built in 1950. Scientists from all the other Soviet republics live here, including the German SSR. You need to have an exceptionally brilliant and dedicated mind to work here. Would you care for some more soda, comrade? Sure, thanks. Looks like another bot got stuck in a tree. <laughs> that always cracks me up. Is that still working on the robot's navigation system? Yeah, I noticed. Wow, what a beautiful day. What's up with your Vovas bots, Andre? They're going haywire. What the hell did you do to them? They've been lying there all day. Number three is bought. I need these houses painted, but look at what they're doing instead. Give me your control code. I'll set them straight. Hold piggies with you. Oh, thanks, Mum. Uh, the code's 0451. Okay, then. Get to work, you bums. Move it! Move it! Whoa! You did it! Oh, thanks a million. And enjoy the celebration. Good morning, my boy. How are you? Did you sleep well? Good morning, Dr. Sechenov. I slept fine. Waiting orders. How do you like the new glove? Better than the old one. It's growing on me. I'd expect nothing less. I designed the device myself. Be careful with it now. It's more important than you might think. Yes, Dr. Sechenov. I'll keep it safe. Report to the lab to complete your integration with the glove. I've got a full schedule today, so Mikhail Stockhausen will get you up to speed. I'll be in touch later. Roger that. You've been ordered to the laboratory, Comrade Major. There is a turbine waiting for you at the airway. Are your orders clear? Crystal, get off my case already. I'm pleased to hear you don't have any questions, for once. You dickhead. Icarus platform residents and facility guests. The address by the Director General of Facility 38. Hey, that bot's actually pretty good. Nice coordination. Did you just praise a robot? I'm amazed. That's because it's not constantly trying to give me unsolicited advice. Perfect. Are they getting 
I had my pollen retreat yesterday, and I feel really great. And I've already started studying physics and chemistry. Step right up. You can become part of the collective with a thought device. Oh, what a rendition. Become part of the collective neural network today. Assemble near the Brown Plate Memorial for a tour. about the history of facility 3826 hear about its great discoveries and pay your respects to all the victims of war everyone here seems so happy and content just like in china you've been to china comrade major i've been everywhere i mean everywhere except for china i guess facility 3826 isn't all that far from our chinese allies i like their spirit and i hear it's nice there indeed it is it's too efficient. And wait, this isn't a formal letter, damn it. Yep, we're scientists now. So it is a war. You fought in the war, comrade Major. Did you just remember something? No, I can't remember shit. I've been drawing a blank ever since I got injured. It's like there's something stuck in my head, but I... I can't figure out what it is. Crispy critters, man. Fuck. Watch your language, Major. We're in a public place. Yeah, whatever. Major Nachai reporting for duty on Comrade Sechenov's direct order. Welcome, Comrade Major. Today is a joyful occasion. The birthday of Collective. Yeah, yeah, many happy returns. Cut to the chase, would you? I've got places to be. Naturally. This is the future of Soviet education. A personal project of Dr. Sechenov's poly education. Gone are the days when Soviet citizens had to spend years studying at educational institutions. From this moment on, just inject a special neuropolymer encoded with the education you want, a university-level natural sciences curriculum, for example, and you'll instantly become an educated member of society. Want to learn Korean? Or get a doctorate in nuclear physics? Or learn to play the piano? With Collective 2.0, you can. Yeah, 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 been there, done that. Skip the foreplay, bot. Excuse me, of course. Your particular case definitely calls for something more efficacious. Nevertheless, you will still need an initial neuropolymer injection. <laughs> Comrade Sechenov is expecting you, Agent P3. I've been informed of your imminent arrival. Here, take this capsule. your glove with scanner functionality. Using the neuropolymer as a conduit, the sensors in your glove are now directly connected to your neural system, especially your eyes, polymer retina. 
To activate the scanner, just make a special gesture. Please choose an object of interest and extend your arm toward it. The palm of your hand should be facing the object. Contract all the fingers on your hand, except for your thumb and index finger. Extend your thumb and index finger to form a right angle to activate the scanner. Holy shit, bot. Who designed this thing? The Spanish Inquisition? Demon, be gone! <laughs> For your information, that's a highly user-friendly gesture. It was developed by our leading expert in the field of advanced interpretive avant-garde absurdist Dadaism. Whatever that guy's been smoking, sign me up. Didn't you say you were in a hurry just a moment ago? Shut your trap and keep scanning, would ya? I'm getting acquainted with the new hardware. You are now capable of seeing hidden objects. This ability could prove very useful in the future. But for now, please continue with your mission. by the Director General of Facility 3826, Dr. Sechenov is about to begin. Greetings, comrades. I am Dmitry Sechenov, and this is Facility 3826. Hello, welcome to your future. Exaggerating. Just look at how our beloved Soviet Union has been transformed in the last few decades. 